Hi friends since the inception of human kind and the transformation of an ape like creature into an homo sapien humans have evolved in culture knowledge art literature and lifestyle there are several less talked about ancient civilizations that have laid the foundation of our modern world today let's talk about some of the most prominent ancient civilizations that changed humanity indus valley civilization the indus valley civilization was one of the oldest if not the oldest civilization in the whole entire world it flourished during the bronze age and was situated in the northwestern part of the indian subcontinent this rightly proves the belief that when majority people around the world were living in caves people in the indian subcontinent were running full fledged civilizations the residents of the civilization were way ahead of their time there were granaries bath halls and well planned drainage systems replicating our modern drainage system The people of the Indus Valley or the Harappan people were super smart when it came to measurements and calculations. In fact, the weights and measures that the Harappans used were reflected even in Kautilya's Arthashastra. All the cities were planned in a well-structured and highly uniform grid pattern. There was presence of beautiful artifacts and also pottery, like the dancing girl, the priest king, the male dancing torso, the reclining mofflon. Apart from this there is evidence that suggests that the Indus Valley civilization was the first one to use a wheel. They also had an extensive canal network and dockyards for boat transport. Every good thing comes to an end and even this wonderful civilization abruptly ended one day. No one knows the true reason behind it. Some say it was due to climate change or a drought. Others keep pushing the idea that there was an Aryan invasion and some say it was an earthquake that destroyed the thriving civilization. Sumerian civilization The Sumerian civilization emerged during the Copper Age and Early Bronze Age. It was located in southern Mesopotamia on the banks of the river Tigris and Euphrates, which is modern-day Iraq. Many historians believe that the Sumerians created writing and were the first ones to maintain written records. The origins of the Sumerians is debatable as some believe they were northern African while others believe they were west Asians. Each Sumerian city has its own king and separate god too. The Sumerians gave us the concept of 60 minutes in an hour and also that there are 360 degrees in a circle. Sun-dried bricks were made to make the buildings and residences. There is a tower called uh, the Tower of Babel mentioned in the Bible. Historians believe that this tower was the ziggurat situated in the Sumerian city of Erodu. So the Sumerians were also well versed with hydraulic engineering. Just like in India we have epics like Mahabharata and Ramayan the Sumerians created their own epics called the epic of Gilgamesh that taught the reader about morality and good conduct the Shulgi of Ur who was a Sumerian king even erected a huge wall to avoid invasions unfortunately in 1750 BCE the Sumerian civilization came to an end with the invasion by the Elamites the Inca civilization The Inca civilization was situated in the continent of South America in places like Ecuador, Peru and Chile. Machu Picchu which is a world heritage site is known for its beautiful architecture was also a part of the Incan civilization. The Incas worshiped the sun god. They were excellent farmers and grew more than 70 different species of crops and were also well versed in performing successful skull surgery. they built monuments just by stones rather than mortar inca people were also very wonderful at bookkeeping and accounting and had an effective system that notified them about debts supplies and stocks they had as the civilization was situated on top of mountains they started creating terraces to get a flat surface freeze drying which is a process of removing excess moisture out of edibles by freezing them was also discovered by the incas The Incas were excellent at preserving the dead. That's why the world was shocked when the mummified body of a Inca girl was found in great condition even after thousands of years. She was named Momia Juanita and it's believed her life was taken from her as a part of a sacrifice in 1440 or 1480 when she was only about 12 to 15 years of age. The Incas were also known to have made many dangerous rope bridges. and many inca engineers lost their lives in the process of making these bridges in 1532 a civil war took place where several inca soldiers were killed 
and the last reigning emperor atavalpa was executed this marked the end of the inca civilization the maya civilization the maya civilization was present mostly in the regions of present day mexico and central america unlike the inca and aztec civilizations maya civilization didn't have a centralized political system there was also a great divide between the rich and the poor the mayas had their own writing system made up of 800 glyphs in order to create trade routes the mayans also cleared forests and swamps they created an underground reservoir for irrigation as there was scarcity of water in the region they wrote books which were basically folded in the shape of an accordion called codices these books had deep insights about astronomy medicine mathematics and history the 2012 phenomenon that said that the world will end on 21st december 2012 was also because of the mayan or the mesoamerican long count calendar that ended on 21st december 2012 the mayans just like the incas carried out human sacrifice and believed in multiple gods they considered their kings to be direct descendants of god just like the ancient egyptians the mayans constructed pyramids one of the famous one is el castillo that served as a temple for the deity kalkulkin in 1524 kish maya was defeated at the battle of utatlan which ended the great civilization but this does not mean that each and every mayan descendant vanished in fact there are many mayan people who live among us even today and speak the mayan languages too ancient egypt probably the most talked about civilization from where new discoveries are reported almost every day is the ancient egyptian civilization it is located in the african continent near the river nile apart from the well known pyramid of giza the great sphinx nefertiti the hieroglyphics king tutankhamun the several mummies there are several other lesser known interesting facts about ancient egypt the ancient egyptians used moldy bread to cure wounds and cuts beer was consumed extensively and many ancient pharaohs were overweight the laborers went on labor strikes having a lot of body hair was frowned upon and the world's first waxing paste was created in ancient egypt servants were covered in honey to keep flies away from the pharaohs both men and women wore makeup made of lead copper and loved cats some people also believe that king tutankhamun lost his life because of a hippopotamus that charged at him and squashed him to death they had over 2000 gods and goddesses and ancient egyptian men and women were treated equally women could own buy sell inherit property work and even divorce their husbands and raise their children single handedly also it was not compulsory for the king to always be a man even a woman could be a king or in other words a queen talking about queens cleopatra was one of the most famous egyptian queens she was said to be the most beautiful woman in the world but the coins that were made at that time suggest that she had a very pronounced chin a big nose and deep set eyes but there is no proof to back this claim due to lack of eye witnesses but majority historian suggests her real beauty was in her sweet voice and her behavior also she wasn't egyptian by birth but rather a macedonian origin woman the empire ended with the death of cleopatra and egypt was absorbed by rome so friends i hope you liked the video for more such videos please like share subscribe click the bell icon and i'll see you next time thanks for watching